attempt to succeed where others have failed. Ahead of them is the chance to capture a golden treasure, but to do so will require the utmost courage and determination. For they are about to land at Fort Boyard. Boyard off the coast of France this week, a team from Woking in Surrey. The captain is Mark Davy, a 36-year-old engineer. Christine Chamberlain, she's 29 and a flight attendant. David Chew is 34, he's a police officer and works as a dog handler. Claire Hills, she's a sales executive and is 26 years old. Neil Franklin is 26 and is a professional squash player. Together, can they succeed? Yeah! This is Fort Boyard. It's an incredible place, isn't it? Yeah! And it's guardian of not only gold, but of mind-bending, body-wrenching ordeals. And it's going to push you harder than you ever thought possible. To get your hands on the gold, which is guarded by tigers, you must first obtain the four keys required to unlock the treasure room door. This you do by overcoming challenges in the cells of the fort, within the allotted times and by answering correctly riddles set by the professor in the watchtower. Once you have enough keys, you must then discover the secret code word which you will ultimately need to spell out correctly on the treasure room floor in order to release that gold. So a tough time ahead, but you'll sail through it. The only storm cloud on the horizon is Boyard, master of the fort. <laughs> what you lot laughing at? I hope you're not laughing at me, because I'm not here to make you laugh. I'm here to make your life a misery, because that's what I do best. Where'd you get this lot from? <laughs> Car boot sale? Don't listen to him. He had a very unhappy childhood. Now, remember, you need to get the four keys to open the treasure room door later on, and then we will have to find the clues to the code word that will release the gold. So what have you got for us first? We're going to start with a riddle. So you, you're going out to the watchtower to meet the professor. He'll set you a riddle. And if you get it right, you'll get your first key. And that's a pretty big if. Jules, take him away. Good luck, Dave. Dave. You can do it. Come you can do on, it. And don't worry, if Dave doesn't get it right, there's still a chance to get the key. It just means that one of you is going to have to jump into the sea and swim for it. <laughs> Neil. Well named, Neil. <laughs> I don't like you and I don't think I'm ever going to like you. In a moment, the gong will sound. Then you'll have exactly 40 minutes before you get to the treasure room door. By then, you need four keys and a code word. Are you ready? We're ready! Yeah. Yeah. We're ready! Monsieur Le Ball, strike the gong! Hello, come up, Jules. Uh, Monsieur, bon appris, whatever it is, uh, and welcome. Ah, uh, you are puffed. Yes, I love looking at the sea from here. I, I don't want to be any part of it. I mean, all you can do is go abroad on it. And who wants to do that? Hmm? <laughs> now, this is what you want. Am I not right? That's what I've come for. Good. Then you have a riddle to do, and if you get it right, you have it. And if you don't, it goes out of the window. So, riddle one. This metal is so poisonous, some people want to ban it. The namesake of a Roman god, it also is a planet. Come on, say the time, Jude. The namesake of a Roman god, it also is a planet. Mars. No. Uranium. Uranium, <laughs> Uranus, Mars, <laughs> Jupiter, Pluto. Mm, more, um, more, more. Plutonium. Pluto. No, no, no. Uh, <laughs> one more. It. You've just got one more to go. You've done the level and... No. Venus. No. Venus, Jupiter. No. A metal. A metal. Okay. Ah, pity. No. The time was up. The yes, word was Mercury. Oh. <laughs> so out of the window it goes, and someone must swim for it. 
And then you move down the spiral. Oh, oh. It's got you. Yeah. <laughs> so, back to looking at the sea, I suppose. Did you get hit? No! Get swimming! Oh, oh no! Come on, guys, we've got to go swimming for it. Wow! Oh, no, the bad oh, news is Neil. No, Dave didn't get it right. The good news is you get to swim for oh, it. Oh, lovely! <laughs> Off you go. <laughs> Our first key. You can do it. You can do it. Nice swallow, Neil. Now, in your, in your own time. Yeah. yeah. Well done. Come on. You're doing really well. Keep going, Keep Almost going. there. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. You got it, you got it. Well done. Well done. You did brilliantly. Good you did really, really well. You did really well. You stay here, get yourself dried off. We'll go on to the next challenge. We've got our first key. Good on you. Well done. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, I haven't got all day. <laughs> well, thanks to you, one of your friends has had a little swim. He needed that swim. <laughs> so when you're got the key. going for a walk. <laughs> and if you're still walking, when the time runs out, you'll be watching the rest of this rabble through the bars of a cell. <laughs> you ever oh, seen Peter know. Pan? I have, yes. Well, he could fly. You no. can't. <laughs> but we're very kind. <laughs> We're going to give you a little apparatus to wear. <laughs> this is just too nice of you, Boyard. Yes, What's happened to you? You're so Because you're as good as a guy on the riddle, you're going to need it. <laughs> oh, no. Rocky Siri. But he ain't that Siri. Oh, right, okay, Jack, let him in. Go, go for it, Mark. Go, Mark. Go, Mark. Go, Mark. Go, Mark. Right, time. Give me up. Your time starts now. Come on, Mark. Come on, Mark. Come on, Mark. Come on. Use the ledges. Tell him to use the ledges. Yeah. Mark the ledges. the ledges. Stay on the ledges. He's got to get himself I across. I stay on there. Keep going. Traverse it. Keep going. Using the ledges, oh. and the key will be in the next window. You need go to get faster. Go. No. If you can use the highest ledges, then they'll get there faster. Stay on the ledges. Keep going to the window. The window. There's a cage on the window. Got a key in it. Come on, come on. Come on, faster. Come on. You can do this. Come on, Mark. You can do it. He's got to get back as well. Yeah. Come on. Cage on the window. There's a cage. Come on. Come on. Come on, faster. He's almost there. You're doing well, Mark. You're doing really well. Grab that key and get back as fast as you can. Come on! Come on, keep going! Come on! Come on. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going.
goes. No. He got the no. key, just didn't make yeah, it back no. in time. He's going to be kept prisoner now. Lavor will take him to the dungeons, but we'll get him back after the challenges. Sorry, Mark, just too right. slow. Lavor's going to take you to the dungeons. We'll see you later. Sorry, Come on, guys, boys. let's go. Hey, Smell of success. I've got one down, four to go. <laughs> well, we can still do this. Don't let him get to you. We can still do it. The pen is mightier than the sword, they say. We'll try and write a sentence with what you find in there. Come on, Dave. Jack, Come the door. On, Come on. Your you time can... starts now. Come on, Dave. 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 Let's get out some Come on. Can you see the key? The key is on the rope. He needs to get the sword and he needs to break the rope to get the key. Right. Come on, Dave! Oh, Come on, Dave! That's it. No, 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 get both feet up there. Both feet up. Both feet up. Pull it out there, Dave. Come on. That's it. Left to right, left to right. Keep pulling up. Keep pulling. Oh, that's, 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 that's it! Come on! Come on, Dave! Come on! Come on, Dave! 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 Get it out! That wasn't Come on. easy. A lucky day, though. Bad luck. Never mind. We've still got one key. We've still got time to get the other three. So let's go. Come on. I tell you what, to make up for it, you can go and see the professor. Jules, take him away. Good luck, Dave. Good luck. Come on, Dave. Come on, Dave. Come on, Dave. Come on. <laughs> oh, I love it. <laughs> you heard the expression, right up a drain pipe? <laughs> well, that's going to be you. Jack, on, yeah. the door. Yeah, come on. Your time yeah. starts yeah. now. Go, 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 go,
time. You did so well. Well done. Well done. It's our second Excellent. key. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So, encore, monsieur. <laughs> oh, it's always pleasant to talk to young athletes. Uh, my great aunt Elsie was an athlete. She thought nothing of swimming, diving, running, hopping for hours on end. She thought nothing. Well, she, she thought nothing Thank most you. of the time. It's a f family tray, unfortunately. <laughs> but <clears throat> now here we go. The uh, second riddle. And here we start. The board is covered in triangles. And if I'm not mistaken, this ancient game makes up its name from two different sorts of bacon. What is it? Come and say it with the time. The board is covered in triangles. Backgammon. parfait. Excellent. I just said the right word. Go! Shh. Down the crooked escalier. <laughs> uh, bon chance. Thanks, Professor. Love you. <laughs> no swimming this time. Yes! Yeah! Got it. Yes! That's our third key. We only need one more. Come, Come on. on. Well, at least Come he's on. done something right. <laughs> but the weather's on my side, so if you want to drink a water, you best wait until it rains. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like seafood? Shellfish? No? Well, that's a shame, because you're going to see what it's like to be a shrimp in a net. Jack, the door. Come on. Right, you, on, can Chris. 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 you can do it. Your time starts now. Go, come, come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Tell us, tell us. The key is in the box in the middle. The key is in the box in the middle. There is a tool at the end. She needs to unhook the tool to unlock the box to get the key. Right, Chris, get, get to the end. Go, All the way to the end. Get the tool. Come on, Chris, get the tool. Easy, was it? That wasn't easy. Never mind. We've got our three keys. Let's try and get our fourth. Come on. So far, things seem to be going my way. Next, Neil has to hang loose, and Claire and Dave get dumped on. <laughs> So the net result is you've only got how many keys? Well, we've got three. That's not bad. That's pretty good. Oh, well, there's more than three ways to walk across a room without touching the floor. One of them is to walk across the ceiling. Jack, 
the door. <laughs> okay, okay, come on, do it. Your time, time starts you now. Come on, yeah. you can do it. Watch. Have a look, okay. Neil, see what you got. The key is at the end of the room. He needs to climb up and put his feet in those stirrups. I said he'll climb up. Feet in the stirrups, keep far in. Can you see the key? It's at the end of the room. He's got to climb. Come on, Neil. Come on. Get your feet in the stirrups. Come I'll on, say, both feet in the stirrups. Then One. he needs to... One done, now two. Come on. Now I'm going to start it. to go. Come now, on. Whatever he does, Come on. Whatever he does, tell him not to take his feet out of the stirrups. Right, don't take your feet out of the stirrups. Keep it's the easier. pressure on. Keep, Keep that's the pressure that's on the string. Come on, now, faster. You've got to go faster. Keep his feet in the stirrups. Keep going. Come on. You were very, very close. We've still got three keys. Next challenge. Let's hope we can get our fourth. Let's go. Oh, you're making it so easy for me. Take them back to the cart boot sale that you got them from. Come on, team. Yeah, or you. Come on, team. There's only four of you. Did you have your hair done before you left? <laughs> no? Well, you're going to get it done now, and your mate's going to take it out. Well, no. get by the door, Jack. Come on, you sir. Let's go for it. The door. Okay. Let's go. Right. Time, on it. Have a nice time. Yeah. Okay, you can do it. Okay, the key. Come on, guys. The key in one of the boxes above them. They need to get that stick. That's it. Hit the latches. Tell them to hit the white latches. Hit those white latches. The white end. Turn the stick around. Turn the stick around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. That's it. Knock the white latches. Knock it. Knock it. Come on. Knock the white latches. That's it. That's the white. The key will be yeah. out. Room. Let's go. Come on, come on. The clock's ticking away. Oh, you look much better now you did before you went in. Well done, guys. We did it. We got all of the keys. Well done. Yeah.
Right. You've struggled so far, this is the easy bit. Come on. All we've got to do is put the keys in the lock. It's not difficult, even for you lot. Next time, stay away from low-flying seagulls, you two. <laughs> All right, don't be so smug. So far, it's been a nursery slope for you. Get ready for the avalanche. This is where things heat up. Now you have the four keys, the treasure room door will open for two minutes after the next gong sounds. But in order to release the gold, when you enter, you will need to be able to spell out correctly the secret code word. You will now have the chance to win clues as to what that code word may be. The code word is the one word which has a link or association with all the clue words. Each time you succeed at a challenge, you gain another clue word. <laughs> but I'm not going to make it easy for you. You'll get the first clue up in the watchtower from the professor if you can get the riddle right. And Dave, it's up to you. Hope you can get it. You're get it out of my sight. Good luck. Come on. Welcome back. Yay! Come on, oh, see? Let's go, come on. Come on. Ah. Hello. Oh. Back again. Oh, mademoiselle. Oh, no, not mademoiselle. <laughs> Monsieur. Cakes. Oh, what has happened to you? I'll oh. be making cakes. <laughs> you know, I I've just been thinking. I'm going to move. I mean, I've been here for ages, and one should move on. I mean, all I want is a place in the sun, away from the rest of the world, with a good observation tower, where I can look at the sea and think. I'm going to stay, aren't I? Oh, <laughs> well, now, riddle numero trois, as the French so wittily put it. Now, I'm going to give you three definitions of yes. the same word. Hmm? Right, here's the first. It usually comes before breakfast. It comes before breakfast, night. No. Two, you often get bored after it. Bored sleep. No. Night sleep, night, bored. Third, bored after. just a minute. It's a popular place to take someone you love. Breakfast of hotel, motel. No. In. Mm. Bed. Yes! Oh, 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 how clever. Yes. Well, down you go to your friends. Thank you. And don't oublier that word. They will play the cakes. <laughs> Promise. Ah. Have you got what it takes to play with snakes? Are you never gladder when you're faced with an adder? <laughs> because down there, two of my little slippery friends have got half of a clue word on each of them. So two halves make one whole. So what you have to do, you two, is to go off and get ready for the next challenge. <laughs> Take them away. Off oh, you go. Good luck, guys. I don't know what you're looking so happy about. No, you're going down. So, Jack, open the hatch. And oh. just to be kind, you have a ladder. I'm going to give you a ladder so you can Welcome play your ladder. own little snakes and ladders. And remember, you've got to find two halves of a word, time, which okay. makes one okay. word. Okay. There you okay. Did you get the clue, Dave? Yeah, I've got a clue. What is it? Bed. Bed. So well done. Bed. Fantastic. Right behind you, Claire. Just That's take two. your time. Take the first time. clue's bed. Let's hope we can get this take one, Claire. Time, you can Claire. do it. Claire. Pick them up. Look under their bellies. Keep going, Claire. Come on. Doing really well. Doing really well. Doing really well. Doing really well. Come on. Check them all out. You want at a time that you pass. Look at look at them completely, Claire. You need to pick them up. Oh, one at a time. Pick them up at the right end of them. Claire, listen. You need to pick them up as you physically turn them. Listen, Claire. Look underneath Claire. them. Claire, one at a time, Claire. One at a time. One at a time. Otherwise, you're going to get confused what you've done. That's better, Claire. Claire. That's better. That's it, Claire. There's a barrel at the back. Look in the barrel at the back. Listen, Claire, that's it. That's it, well done. In well there. Come on, Claire. Come on. Just turn, Claire. 
Oh, oh, Claire, oh. Jane, come on. Open them up, Claire. You need to uh, have a look completely. Claire, listen. Make sure you look properly. You need to open them up, Claire. You need to open them up and look but underneath. But be careful. Come on. Check it out. All right, all right, all right. Check it out. Keep... Claire, can you see the cupboard with the red door? There's a white yep. rope on it. Pull the white rope as hard as you can. Go on, Claire, keep going. Come on. Go on, Claire, pull, Claire. As hard as you can. Come on, Claire, pull. Oh. Come on. Might be. It's the word that links the clues together. So be thinking about what that might be. Let's go on to our next adventure. Let's go. We've got two clues already, so come on, give us our third. All right, now look on this as a day out of the seaside. Only trouble is the sea's on my side. There's a very, very strong current, so I hope you're strong swimmers, because your clue's down there on that pontoon. Now, you've got to swim down to the lobster pot. When you get the lobster pot, swim to that pontoon, because your friend will already be there. Hopefully, you'll be able to open the lobster pot without too much difficulty and find the clue inside the mailbox that's on there. All right? Now get on your contraption and get ready to go. Antoine, take him away. Dave, get ready for the next adventure. You know You'll like, take on, him Dave. away. Now, Christine, let's go. Dive under, 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 come on, dive under the boy and grab the lobster pot let's go, and swim on. it into the water. Come on, Chris, come on. Burn up and we've lost it, so let's hope oh, it gets... now! Let's keep it going! Come on. It's the white boy! He needs to go to the white boy! Yeah. Three clues. 
In a moment, Dave studies insect behaviour and marks for the high jump. Now we've got three clues, we've got bed, we've got break and we've got gate. And the code word will be the word that links them together. Now we need to find the next clue. There are six words here. One of them is the clue word, but to find out which one we have to eliminate the rest. Mark, go and get ready for the next adventure. I'll deal with you in a minute, just as soon as I've finished off this oh. slime ball. Go on, Davidson! Oh. Outside on the board is six words. Only one of them is any good. So to eliminate the five that are useless, you've got to go on a little journey through five little chambers. Yeah. And in each chamber is a word. But also in those chambers are a few things that you don't really want to meet. <laughs> so if I was you, I'd keep your eyes open and your mouth shut. Flip. Otherwise, you'll be going home with a frog in your throat. Are you ready? Of course. Go. <laughs> Push. Slow, Dave. Go slow. slow. Slow into the first one. Slow. In the box. This box in front of me. Yes. Go yes. But slowly. 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 It's on the right. Slowly. It's on the right. There, there, there. Slowly. There. Slowly. there. Slowly. On the right. Slowly. Back. Right. Got it. Back. What is it? Did you get that? Yes. Thank you, Spurt. Get Spurt. it, right, yeah, one. next one. I'll take you. <laughs> Slowly. <laughs> blow, blow, blow the powder. That's it. It's under there somewhere. Go on, Dave. <coughs> You're doing well. Oh, what is it? Yes. What is it? Well, he's been heading for a fall ever since this program started, and now he's got his chance. But on your way down, <laughs> look out for the clue, because it's somewhere where you keep your brains. Once you've got it, start back up. All right, get up there and go and join Antoine. Okay, the clock's ticking away. You don't have that much time. Go on, son. You can do it.
so far, we've got bed, we've got break, we've got gate, we've got sports, and we've got proof. What is the code word? The code word will be the word that links them all. Right, we've got to make our way to the treasure room. This is when we'll find out whether we're right. Keep, keep thinking, thinking about keep it. Thinking. It's keep important thinking. we get it right. We've got to do on, this. Come on. Okay, let's go. go. Come on. To the treasure room. Go, go, go. Go, 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 go. Come on. Sports. Bed. Before the gong, it didn't take them this long to build this place. No. Well, then, guys, we haven't got much time now. You were talking about what you think that code word might be. What do you think it is? Let's. What are the clues that we've got? We've got bed. Break. We've got break. Sports. Gate. We've got sports. Gate. Yes. Proof. There's a gong. Gate. What do you think it could be? Water. Proof. Proof. Break. Water bed. Got to be quick. Water what do you think break. it is? Water. water. You think water. it's water? Are you certain? Yeah. Yeah. Organise yourselves. You need to go right. in there and spell out the word. Right. It's got to right. be spelt exactly. W-A-T-E. Where's Mark? Use the cannonballs if you don't, if you don't have a name. People. Just go. I'll get are you door. certain you know what the word is? You're are you certain? You're on. You're on. You're on. You're on. You're on. Right, get in there. Water. As fast as you can. Tiger Master, the tiger's head, please. Now let's see if they're right. The code word was water. The clues were gate, as in Watergate. Break, as in breakwater. Sports from water sports, and proof as in waterproof. The answer to the riddle was bed from water bed. The code word was water. Rub from me. Come on. Come on. Oh. Not bad. Let's have a look. What how did you It do? won't be a lot. You've got 8,850! Yeah. Golden to blend! That is gonna be converted into hard cash for you later on. Well done. That is fantastic. Excellent. Well I'm annoyed. And when I'm annoyed, Hannibal Lecter looks human. <laughs> Bring on the next bunch of morons. <laughs> He should really get out more often. It's quite sad. sad it's quite sad. Have you enjoyed yourselves? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You've been successful, you've done it, but Mark, how about that bungee? I've loved it. <laughs> you loved it? Are you a good liar? Yeah, <laughs> Have you ever done one before? No, that's the first time. First time, would you do it again? Um, no. <laughs> I don't blame you. I but you all so. did really well. You worked really hard. And we did it. You got the goal. Yes, That's fantastic. And I'll be back soon with another team of men and women hoping to conquer the challenges of Fort Bayard. Goodbye.